Wednesdays, we are pink, the 7th of April. You guys will be able to do fact trinomials when A equals 1, section 7.4. We are finishing up section 7.4 today. We started it last class last week, okay, before our little break there around Easter, okay? I hope you guys enjoyed your break, by the way. Um, nice five-day weekend, okay? We already did examples 1, 2, and 3. Is that correct? Yeah. Okay? But we have not done examples 4, 5, and 6. Is that correct? Yeah. Okay. Do you guys notice any examples after 4, 5, and 6? No. Okay. Do you guys notice any other stuff on the sideboard for today? No. No. Okay. What's that probably mean then? We got homework. Okay, well, there, there will be homework, but the rest of the time will be homework time. We're going to have a lot of homework time today. Okay. Like, so much. Yeah, she just, like, fist pumped there. Fist pumped there. She's like, here, okay. Where are we going? Okay. I don't know. This is going to be difficult to do I don't know about that. No. I wouldn't go that far. Okay, okay. Wait, are we just doing four, five, and six? Yeah. What happened? Yeah. Dude. Dude. And then we can play a game. Can we oh, do a nap? Please. Can we play that game? Sure. Oh, yeah. You know what game we're talking about? Yeah. All right. Number four. X squared plus 4X plus 2. Is this three terms? Yeah. Yes. Does it look like we can use our shortcut? Yeah. Heck yeah. Is there a GCF? Who said no? no. Tobin, okay. you're excommunicated. Okay. okay. You know what that means? No. You're kicked out. We can't, you can never talk to us ever again. It's like banishment. Awesome. Okay. Awesome. All right. Let's make your X here. What goes at the top of this X? Two. Two, it's R-E times C. What goes at the b -b 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 bottom? Four. Four, it's R-B. Okay, what are two numbers that can multiply to two? Two positives. And add to four. It would be two positives, but what are the factors of two, guys? Only two, two and one. Only two and one. Wait, would two and one ever add up to four? So it should be three on the bottom. Hmm, hmm. So, so, so can we can we do this problem? No. It'd be prime. Yeah. Prime. Have we seen a problem like that before? Yeah. Yeah, we have, right? Okay. When you can't complete the x like that, it's prime. Okay. Ooh, that's that's a surefire way to get a lot of them wrong. It's a bold strategy, Cotton. I don't think it'll work well for you. Okay. Questions on number four? No. I want to start pouring. I hope it doesn't. Just because you have soccer. Yeah. I mean, okay. <laughs> oh, yes. After soccer. Sure, no, that's fine. No, no. Oh, no, no, no. Mrs. Zazzle said no. No, okay. no. I'm on the no side of things. No. My husband's trying to get all his terrace work done because then they got to go to the field. So if it rains and you can't get the terrace work done, and I'm sick of being by myself every night. <laughs> <laughs> but, but it doesn't make any difference. We can let it rain. Because it's like, if it rains, then he'll get to come home. But then he's going to go right to the field. So. Mm. I just want a big thunderstorm. Yeah. All right, number five. What do we notice is a little different on number five? It's A. There's like There's A. And B. There's two different variables, right? Oh, have we seen problems like with two different variables before, guys? Yeah. Yeah. We're okay with those. We know how to do those. Okay, calm down. How many terms do we have? Two. Three. Three. Okay, three terms. Okay, okay. Let me put it away. Thank you. Okay. Um, so we have three terms. Do we have a GCF? Is there anything that can be taken out of all three of these terms? No. no. I would agree. I would agree there's not. not. Okay. Let's make an X. What goes at the top? 20. Negative 20. Negative 20. And at the bottom is negative 8. Very good, Reagan. So what, what kind of signs are we going to have if they multiply to a negative? Two the same or two different? Two the same. Two same. It's different. Different, different signs for the negative. Negative and positive. Now, two factors of 20 that are really going to subtract to get 8. Why do I say they're really going to subtract? Why am I saying they're really going to subtract instead of adding? Because they're going to subtract. Okay, because they're going to subtract. <laughs> but well, how do we know they're going to subtract? Am I just making that up? Am I just making it? Because there's a negative and a positive. When they combine, they're going to end up subtracting, okay? So what are some factors of 20? 10 and 2. 10 and 2, okay? That, would that work? Yeah. Okay. So, which one is negative, 10 or 2? 10. So, just to double check, guys, not a bad, bad idea to double check here. Negative 10 times 2, is that negative 20? Okay. Negative 10 plus 2, is that negative 8? Yeah, okay, it does work. We can continue. Now, at this point, we do our shortcut, right? Now, typically for our shortcut, right, we make the two parentheses, 
And how would I start both of these parentheses on this problem? A. With an A, right? Okay, and then I do like minus 10, and I do plus 2, right? Now, what are we noticing I'm missing? B. B. Here's what we're going to do. That's literally the only difference, okay? So here's what I did, okay? Just so we see. I said, hey, right now, we just have our A's. We're missing our B's. Is there any A's on the first term? No. no. So I need, some, I need the A's to be left alone. So I put the B's on the last term. And just like I need two A's because we have A squared to start, I need two B's because we have B squared to end. Okay? If we were to multiply back through, combine like terms, a lot of stuff like we learned, we'd get the exact same answer as what we started with. Questions on that? Isn't that? Okay. You guys remember that, like, that uh, fad for a while, like, go crazy. Ah! Go stupid. Ah! Go crazy. Ah! Because, like, the third one was always delayed. All right. Number six. Hey, is number six pretty similar? Yeah, two variables. This time, what are the variables? Um, X, and y. X and Y. How many terms are there, Hannah? Three. Three. You were ready for that one this time. You're like, I got it wrong last time. I'm getting it right this time. Okay. Now, is there a GCF here? No. Two. Two. Oh, that's good. It's Casper. Thank you, Lainey. All right. So if we take out a 2 of everything, we have to divide everything by 2. 2x two squared divided by 2? X squared. Negative 20 xy divided by 2? Negative 10 xy. 48 y squared divided by 2? 24. Ha ha. Y squared. Now, we have three terms. We can use the shortcut. Okay. And what do we do here? We, we make we make a thing. We make an X. Okay? What goes at the top of this X? Can someone help me? It's going to be 24. Okay? Because it's A times C for inside the, the parentheses. Not the original. We don't have to do 2 times 48 and say 96. That would be a problem. Okay? At the bottom, what do we put? Negative 10. It's whatever the bottom is inside the parentheses. The B is inside the parentheses. Not originally. Okay? A positive on the top. What kind of numbers multiply to a positive? Two the same sign or two different signs? Two different signs. Same sign. Same signs. Okay? So if they're going to be two the same sign, are they going to be both going to be positive? Both going to be negative. 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 They both have to be negative here because they add to a negative. Two positives do not add to a negative. It couldn't happen. Okay? So we need factors of 24, haha, uh -huh, that multiply, that, excuse me, that add up to 10. Okay. Okay. Ooh, 6 and 4 are 4 and 6, right? Now, does the order matter here since they're the same sign? No. no. Okay. But okay, okay, okay. Can I, can I say it? Yeah, yeah. Okay. I would make one slight adjustment. Okay, okay, rede redemption. Ooh, there we go. And four there we go. There we go. Okay. Can't forget those Y's. Once we put those in, we are good to go. Okay. Questions on that? Okay. Reminder here. Okay. Just like there's two X's for an X squared. Think of Ms. Haswell. We have two Y's for the Y squared. There's some X's left alone. There's some Y's left alone. So the X's are left alone. The Y's are left alone. Okay. Apart from each other. Does that make sense? All right. Gucci. Gang. Okay. So Gucci. It could be in a gang. So we have more problems today than last time, but we have a lot more work time, okay? So I want you to do numbers 8 through 9, so 8 and 9, okay? Yep, and then I want you to do 12 through 19, okay? Okay. So I'm asking 10 problems this time. I asked for 6 last time. I'm asking for 10 this time, okay? Um, I'm still not going to make you do them. Okay, okay. So, y'all, if you look, you got just over 50 minutes. Bro, that's a 